already guys well from the start this video probably looks a little different from the, la the ones I've been doing lately but that's because the battery went dead in my new one so I gotta use my old uh, 4 meg yeah 4 megapixel must tech whatever the hell whatever freaking man but um got these uh these fog lights from Walmart they were um 20 bucks the, the only reason I got them because uh, they have this nice little bracket in the back of them so I'll be able to um, just uh, zip, uh, zip tie them right on my grill and uh, they already come with the uh, those little plug in wires and uh, got the whole bag of, of crap right here comes with switches and stuff but um, I'm gonna hook these up to my parking lights so whenever my parking lights come on uh, they're gonna come on with them so, uh, cause uh, I had a, I was up at um, up at my college two, three years ago, and um, I had them on the money, and I had to switch them on my dash. I forgot and left them on, and uh, I went to like two classes, I think. It was like two and a half hours, and um, came out my battery was dead. So um, let me get these uh, mounted up first. Once they're mounted, I'll give you a shot. I'll show you how to wire them up. I gotta find out where I'm gonna wire them up first, so. Be back in a second. Alrighty, guys, well, I kinda ran into a snag here. Um, kinda forgot that, uh, the grill's kinda like in the way of, of the grill, so to speak. <laughs> but they're basically gonna be sitting like this. Cause there's like a little, uh, there's a little uh, spot up here. So it'll sit in there, something like that. But I have to pop the. Uh, I have to pop the. Actually, no. You know what? I think I'll have enough room to pop the uh, headlights out. I got these little, um, little slide clips on there. But um, let's see. pop this headlight out. I got to unplug it and move it out of the way, so yeah, give me one sec. Hey guys, I got the uh, grill off. And, um, let me show you where, the, uh, where I'm going to put it. You can see, if I can have the right angle, you see the little space that's under there? There's another one in there, but there's a space there, and then there's a space underneath. Right there in that hole right there, and that's where I'm going to put my uh, fog lights, and there's another one right there. Uh, I was gonna put it on the top, but then the headlights right next to it. The headlights right there with the parking lights. But um, I'm gonna put them right here underneath the parking lights. Like uh, I don't think no, there's nothing that hooks onto it, so I'm gonna suck it right up just like that. Can't see too much of my fingers. It's gonna be something like that. I'll keep it far away. But um. I got the little screws on here that, I'm, uh, that the bracket comes with. That's what I needed this for anyways. I need the bracket so I could uh, tie it up on here. So um, let me get one side mounted and then I'll come back and uh, I'll show you how it's going to look. And then I'll do the other side and give you a shot afterwards. Then the hard part's going to be trying to wire it all up. So yeah, I'm going to do that next. So after this. So. Alright you guys, well, let me uh, get you a little pick of that, a little view, that's how she looks, she looks good, I zip tied her from the back here, twisted her on the, uh, the little bracket right here, I got my wires right here, running out, I'll show you how to connect those later. But uh, let me grab it, get the other side, suck them in. Alrighty guys, well, I'll show you the finishing touches. Just came out good. It's gonna look good. Show you the wires I got behind there. Sticking out 
they got the plugins on this side. They don't even um stick out much with the uh with the, with the um, home part there. So the uh, ones that these are Walmart ones, twenty dollars. The ones I like about this is um give me this bag. They give you everything you need in there, all your switches, wiring and crap, so um Tripod. Show you what you get in there. Put your switch. Put your switch here. Three wires, power, ground, and then the uh, power supply coming off of the um, lights. And got your uh, positive here from your um for your uh, lights. And what that does is you got this little, the little gold right here. It's got two little uh, ends, and you put the two ends of the um, of the two lights in there. And um, damn, I think I just realized they're a little far apart. So I'm gonna have to see how that's gonna work. Actually, no, because. Two wires here. You got the, your two extension wires for the uh, lights, and this black one right here is for the uh, ground. Okay, let me pick it up and get the rest back. You have your uh, plug in from your ground, and then this uh, extension wire is for the uh, positive. That plug into here, that run to your switch. Now, I'm not running a switch on mine, so. Um, I'm just gonna run this straight to my parking lights, but um, I gotta find out which one's the uh, parking light because uh, I have the flasher and then the uh, constant one. And they give you this fuse protected wire to um, put it for power, but um, I'm not gonna use that. And then got your wires, your negative wires here. Your negative wires that just plug in and then um, uh. You put, you put the ground. Oh, this is for the, uh, this black right here with these, uh, extension wires for the positive. This is for your switch. So you got your switch wire there, your, uh, negative, your ground for your, uh, um, switch, and your, uh, extension, um, for the power, for the power, the power extension wires for the lights. You have your ground for the lights right here because it's already, you would just plug and plug and play. You have to, might have drill a hole though and um, mount it somewhere in the frame or or somewhere so anywhere they get ground on metal. Oh, and this one actually gives you some nuts and bolts. Oh, and you get little mini zip ties and that I don't know what that red thing is right there. I think it's like a pad or something of some sort. But yeah, um, I will show you actually. Yeah, let me. Uh, I'll show you how this is gonna work before I go on the other side try to find a spot for the um for uh the power and ground and all that crap. Guys you see all the spaghetti here? Here's what happened. I've got the extension wires on the negative right I mean a positive right there. Same thing with this one. Extension wires and what they do is they both uh run into this like little uh Y thing here. They plug right into it. And that's where I'm gonna run my positive off of. And then um this negative here. I just ground these, find somewhere in the frame or whatever too. And then that's it. It only took me like less than two minutes to put together, so time to go check out the truck. Alright guys, I got the um the negative right here. I just scraped into the little screw they gave me into it. Um, other side's all set too. Same thing with my wires. Now, all I'm doing here is, um, these, the little Y connector I got here, both of the, uh, both of the lights can run right off of, um, my parking light right here. And I stripped the, uh, the middle wire as the one that, um, it's for the parking light, the, the uh, blue one on the left right here is for the uh, hazard lights. So I'm just going to cut a little chunk of wire off of this. And then just wrap it around. And then just wrap it around my positive right here. And then uh, we'll be good to go. 
zip tie all the wires together and shit so that hang. And we'll be good to go. Alright guys, well, everything is all uh, hooked in the wires and everything, so all I gotta do is put the freaking grill back on and um, put my headlights in and we'll uh, do a quick test. Everything all looks good in there. It's tucked in there and shit. What I do is I just bunched all the wires up together in there. Zip tied them up and shit. There's like a little plaque and it goes right up against this here, so I mean it should be alright. And it'll be pressed right up against there, so everything should be good. Right up against this metal plate right here, so yeah. Oh, I gotta hook up a negative on this side. get another video of it tomorrow, another clip with my other camera, my better one. That way, that way I can see better quality, better charge the battery and it's nice though.